Why? Honestly, why? Who is responsible for giving me the entirety of the nuclear arsenal of the United States of America? In some ways, the game plays a little bit like Risk. You can expand your territory, engage in diplomacy, and I can use the absolute genius of the average Florida man, of which I am one, to start research. Okay, Florida man, what I want you to do is research intercontinental ballistic missiles. So you can see the little research bar there going. Uh, yeah, even though it says the capital's in Washington, D.C., I'm moving it to St. Petersburg, Florida. I'm the president, I'm the commander-in-chief, and we have just absorbed Mexico. Bienvenidos, Mexico, to my glorious nuclear superpower. Oh, yeah, you may be wondering, wait a minute, wait a minute, the world, there's gotta be someone to oppose. The sheer madman that is Baron in, in charge of nukes. Well, it doesn't appear to be the Western European powers or the Russian. Oh, it's the mighty nation of Kazakhstan, which has a quite a big uh, nuclear arsenal. India, oh yeah, and uh, North Korea too, because why not? And North Korea is like, dang, Camp Chow. Whoa, 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 whoa. We have a development. North Korea has invaded Alaska. That, that's an act of war. Kim Jong, whoever you are. ICBM intercontinental rocket was successfully researched. Oh great, I thought we were being launched on. I know exactly what I'm doing at all times. I'm the president. Let's expand and create a buffer state. We need to increase our territory because, get this, the more territory that we have, oh my god, there's an asteroid like flying near planet Earth. Or is that the moon? <laughs> I think that's in fact the moon. Can we invade it? Anyway, but the more territory we have, the more nukes the enemies will have to fire on us. And you know what looks kind of nice. I want a vacation home in Cuba. We're gonna make it the 51st state. Well. 50 seconds. Indian Pakistan first strike detected. Oh my goodness. Nukes are being launched between the three superpowers on the far side of the world. This is what happens when diplomacy fails and crazy people. Whoa, 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 whoa. North Korea is doing a first strike. We need to do a quick defend order. We need to build cruise missiles because they, oh, they fired on neutral Canada actually. I thought they were firing on us. So cruise missiles in this game anyway, are actually a way to defend yourself. They've got this nice little blue shield indicative of, hey, this is defensive weaponry. And then these guys here are offensive weapons. City destroyed, Khartoum was hit. Five million people, oh my gosh, they're nuking Egypt. Why? It looked like India had spread out but got completely demolished. And I'm not entirely sure who it was, but there is mass expansion going on. It's almost like they know exactly what they're doing. All right, so we're expanding out from Central America and Cuba into South America, if we can take that. Chong, Chong King was just hit by a nuke. Part of the Indian territory. Oh, they just shot down a missile, okay. Now, if we could get to Europe, that would be a pretty good thing, wouldn't it? Let's expand here and let's start Texas. Texas with the dollar sign, we need you to research. Let's get a satellite warning system. You will be warned before a detonation on allied nations is imminent. Fantastic, we could definitely use that. So I think the North Koreans were like, you know what, Baron, you're so stupid. Like, you're trying to expand there, we're gonna nuke it, and you can't use it. I'm like, dang man, that's like some 3D chess on my brain right now. I don't know if I like that, but it doesn't matter. They don't care what I like. So do we want to create, we could turn South America into like a just massive, nuclear ordinance. Let's expand further in and then we're just gonna like take over South America. I don't think that they want me to have all of North America and part of the reason you may be like, hey Baron, why are you invading Canada? What did they ever do to you? Well, they topped the World Cup qualifying group. Oh my goodness. North Korea first strike detected. Quick defend, quick defend. Oh my biscuits. Okay, North Korea has done a first strike. The West Coast has been, well, I guess it's like, we lost Las Vegas. My goodness. All right, we need to work on massive defense because the best defense is a strong offense, right? So I'm obviously going all defense because, I don't know. Kazakhstan first strike detected? Where are they firing? Doesn't look like at us. North Korea first strike detected. It's kind of like a game of risk with nukes, right? My God. This is a really, really cool game, but it is intense. You have to be so fast on like defending and there's no pause button. If there was a pause button, I'd be, f I'd be feeling pretty good. I also really, really like the ability to play as like North Korea if I wanted to. So we're gonna take over Colombia and Venezuela and move into the Amazon all the while. Let's get, let's build some IRBMs. Actually, I think 
Yeah, don't we want our BMs? I think that's one of our like specialty weapons. All right, are these missiles coming for us? I would really, really love a pause button just cause like it can be sort of overwhelming. Oh my gosh, most of Asia is pretty much just covered in radioactive waste at the moment. India started in India and is now taking over Africa. You know what? I think we need to build up a first strike and hit North Korea. The downside is we lose all of that delicious street food in South Korea. And Japan, oh man, they took they took some delicious food spots. See, these are the way my strategic decisions are made, is who's got the best food? I don't know. Who put me in charge? You guys did, you voted me as president. I'm, I'm just like the emperor though, in a way. So we're gonna build lots of ICBMs in the areas where we have multiple spots. Oh, quick defend, quick defend, quick defend. We are trying to shoot down as many as we can. Quick defend. Oh, dang, we just took Canada. All right, you know what? I'm getting really sick of your stuff. We're building ICBMs. I don't think you can quick defend why you are building though. And then what we're gonna do is what's known as a first strike. Now, it's not much of a first strike when you've already been getting hit, but we need to mass up a big arsenal of nuclear missiles. They're gonna be firing from, well, all of our territories. This reminds me of this old game by Infinivision, or what were they called? They, they... Defcon, oh my God, did you guys ever play Defcon? Such a good game. California doesn't have, okay, North Korea did a first strike, but it doesn't look like it's at us. It looks like it, oh, Indian Pakistan first strike detected. Oof, Northern Europe's getting wrecked. Oh my goodness, wait a minute. Look at where India expanded to. They're in Australasia and Africa. They're the biggest power right now. Here I was worrying about the North Koreans. All right, you know what? We gotta take over like Sao Paulo and Rio de Janeiro down here. And where's the biggest concentration of enemy forces? At this moment, I can't really tell. And I'm not sure if like conventional weapons work. So let's do attack. Here. All right, we fired a missile. This is our first offensive missile, actually. Um, oh, quick defend. We shot it down. Okay, fantastic. Yeah, you definitely need quite a bit. How are we doing down here? Now, after this battle, I want to show you guys just how amazing it is, the fact that you can start as multiple different nations. Oh, hold on. We did a quick defend. They're launching another one. Who's got this one? Okay, we're doing, we're doing decent. Not great but decent. We've taken a few nukes to the face, which is never enjoyable when it's your face that's getting nuked. All right, let's go and attack. Oh man, I really wanna, oh, can I expand into Alaska? I guess not. They they own the territory and in this game, it's like no conventional warfare allowed, only nukes. So I have to nuke Alaska. That, that kind of makes me sad. Well, nuke away, we're gonna, Oh, they, they shot it down. Oh, they're shooting down all my stuff, man. That's rude, that, that, that's what I do. You're not allowed to do that. <laughs> I don't think they care. Yeah, they're really good at shooting down my stuff. It's like they're learning from me. Kazakhstan first strike detected, uh, where? Those definitely look like they're going for the North Koreans. And we've got some successful strikes here. Was that enough to destroy it? Oh my gosh. All of Eastern Russia is just gone. I hit these with nukes, but it may not have been enough. All right, Indian Pakistan is firing. Oh, wait a minute. They already hold this territory, so I'm thinking, wait a minute. Green versus green is, am I not entirely aware of what's happening in the world? Because it sure seems like it. Oh, quick defend. Whew, this is getting ridiculous. So many missiles are being fired at the same time, all of which have catastrophic potential. Oh, but look at this. We're gonna take like Chile. I think that's like Paraguay and Bolivia, I think. Oh, that nuke looks like it could be going. We could do a quick defend. Oh, it, it's a multiple launcher. Who's firing at who? Was that Sweden? Sweden, you're supposed to be neutral, bud. All right, we're launching at these little uh, Canadian territories. Man, that is, I need to shoot this down before it splits. I, I mean, I'm assuming they're going there, but I can't be certain. North Korea has given up, okay. Wait, then who is this guy? Then that means I should be able to expand into what is left of Canada. Oh, can I take, whoa, can I take that stuff? All right, South America's ours. Let's build up the arsenal. Yeah, the more territory you have, the more you can build. I, I, I don't see any other resources going on right now. This is incredible. Let's do a little bit of research here. Get some advanced tech. We want enhanced capacity four. A new rocket base will raise every nation's rocket capacity to four. 
Mm, I think we want this. Enhanced range on our ICBMs. Absolutely. Man takes over all of South America and fills it with nuclear missile silos. This is kind of cool. Okay, so you can take over old territory. So we can... We're gonna make Canada great again. <laughs> and I guess if a territory is already masked up, then let's start rebuilding other things. What's this? Enhanced espionage. Better spies? You know what? We like spies. Don't we, guys? Look at this. Fortress South America. I'm gonna build some defensive cruise missiles, though. Enhanced range ICBMs are successfully researched. Guys, make Canada great again. And we have Alaska back, so honestly, that's just fantastic. What's this? A trident has three warheads loaded with an area attack. I like the sound of that. Multiple r heads. So it seems to me that we've got the green powers and the blue powers. They've taken Australia and they've made it nice. So we could do a massive first strike, but it would open us up and make us sort of vulnerable. But we have essentially two continents. Yeah, IRBM. We'll build one of those. Oh, and you can take over Greenland and Iceland? Oh, wow, yeah. They have a big ordinance there, and so the biggest threat is definitely India and Pakistan, which now resides in the continent of Africa. <laughs> All right, Florida man, we need your research again. Global Strike Trident, the world's most advanced nuke. Can we research it now? No, I think we have to... Ah, I see how this is working. Triangulation calculation. Ooh, that's a really good one. All right, we've got ton... We have all of the eggheads in the United States and South America working right now. And we are only increasing our arsenal. The issue is, I wish I could color code my defensive stuff. So when I'm like, oh, they're firing and I have like all of my defensive rockets. Oh, first strike on who? Oh. Oh, I love it when they attack each other. Look at this. Okay, so it's three versus what? Five. Do any of them get shot down? Oh my gosh. All of Malaysia and Indonesia, gone. Oh no. Somalia? Somalia and Ethiopia. Oh goodness. The inhumanity. We are going to take over. Enhanced Capacity 4 was successfully successful. I like when things are successfully successful. Gentlemen, we need to research and get more stuff. Faster research. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Nope, I don't want to debuild anything. No, 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 I didn't I didn't mean to do it. Do we have those super advanced things yet? I guess we're still working on them, aren't we? Queuing up things would be really cool too. Oh, look at this. We're gonna take over Manchuria and then we're gonna take over North Korea. We started out as our enemies and North Korea gave up. So who were the other guys? Kazakhstan's over here and is this Indian Pakistan or are they reversed? I guess it would make sense, but I honestly don't know. And Europe is just chilling like, hey man, what's up man? We're good. Superior diplomacy was successfully successful. Florida man is going on to research bigger and better things. The success of our success, well, I would say we've been successful. Essentially what we're trying to do is unlock our two super weapons, the Global Strike Trident and the Stealth Bomber. Nearly undetectable and instantly reusable. The elusive Stealth Bomber. We're gonna use like Guyana and French Guyana and Suriname as basically like our defensive arsenal in South America here. While the innermost territories, like Paraguay here, is just gonna be big old boomskis. Oh! Check that out. We can see their whole ordinance here. Okay, lots of defensive stuff here. Absolute ton of it. Okay, Florida, you know what to do. Yeah, we're going to use our brains, man. That's right, you are. All right, we're taking over the Korean Peninsula and Japan. Our global empire is massive. Aside from getting hit in our Canadian provinces and, you know, the deserts around, uh, I guess, Nevada, we did all right. Radiation countermeasures are done. And war technologies too? Oh, this is it. This is the moment we've been waiting for. The Global Strike Trident. Oh, Indian Pack- Whoa, 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 whoa! This is huge! I'm trying to shoot down as many as possible. It's not enough. Oh, Brazil. Who did it? These guys. Warning, rocket impact imminent? Oh no. I like this early warning stuff though. Okay, we're gonna get hit again. You can quick defend. And then you can not quick defend. This is a lot of missiles, but luckily this superpower is, isn't so super. Oh, Japan, wait a minute. Oh my God. I feel, let's build the super weapon, rocket impact imminent. See, this is what I need pausing. Oh man, we're losing all of this. You know what? 
I'm sick of your stuff. All right, let's do a first strike. We're doing a first strike on Australia. Look at how many nukes that is. Look at how many nukes. <laughs> you messed with the wrong superpower, fella. Was that all of our nukes or just one from all of our territories? Oh yeah, you shot down one. <laughs> you shot down four. There are still so many more. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Australia. I'm so sorry. But Kazakhstan, that's who it was. It's Kazakhstan. I forgot all about them. Oh my gosh. Now what we have to do is start our research again because we need our last super weapon. We've got one enemy left and I'm thinking we need IRBMs because they are really, really hard to shoot down, especially once they split into multiple warheads. But as far as I can tell, that first strike gets everything that you have. But listen, they started it, okay? Oh, 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 oh my god. Oh my god, okay. It's happening. This is nuts. I need I need more quick defense capabilities. And having to manually do it is not ideal at all. Oh. They nuked Greenland. There's going to be global warming. Okay. So here's their main base down here, right? And research is almost done on the Trident. I'm going to give this super weapon a go. But what I want to do, I could engage in diplomacy like, hey, guys, why can't we be friends? All right, so this is this is the super weapon, I guess. Look at this thing. How do you shoot? That thing looks like we're going to another solar system. We'll build another one. <laughs> oh, what did it just drop behind? Was that like a, a uh, the first stage? I don't. Oh, my God. Now it looks like it's going to land. What are we doing? We just what is this thing? A super laser? Oh, my God. It's firing multiple nukes. <laughs> that thing is incredible. It just got shot down. Oh, wow. Well, that was pretty good at distracting them. I'd say we're ready. We're ready for first strike. What are you guys going to do about that? We got stealth bombers coming. Look at these. Mo most of these are going to split into multiple warheads. Indian Pakistan first strike. They're like, oh, you know what? We're going to die here, aren't we? Oh, because everybody's defending here. Uh, quick defend. Who's got the quick defend availables? Oh, uh, we don't have too many available, unfortunately. South America got wrecked. Well, that was a trade-off. All right, stealth bombers are available. Let's choose here. All right, so these things should just go and not be able to get shot down, right? Dang, they're fast. They're faster than ICBMs. Oh, snap. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, they shot it down. They shot it down. I guess once it fired, it was like, you know what? We're only building IRBMs now. And I think we definitely want to do a first strike at... Here would probably do the most, right? There we go. First strike fired. They should be able to shoot down maybe three of these. That's just not enough. And they counterfired with four. Now we fire the quick defense wherever we have them. Did we shoot down them all? We shot down them all. That is delightful okay oh i don't think we have the range maybe we do all right and the trident is ready so we'll launch it you know on i guess that's rhodesia right is it uh is it zimbabwe now and we do have first strike available i guess all right the stealth bomber you're going here the trident's launched and that means we should be able to do first strike here we force them to surrender as a result we've won and uh let's go we've destroyed 73 nations, 5 million casualties. That's not too many, actually. Three enemies defeated in 5,000 megatons. If a megaton is like a mega of tons and there's 5,000 of those, that's quick math. That's a lot of tonnage. Now, here's the cool thing, right? So if you guys do want to see me play again, what we could do is ramp up the difficulty. We start as the United States and get this. Look at our tech level, our country, our uh, intelligence and all that stuff. And then now we can play as Brazil. This wasn't available before I played. Western Europe. We could play as Kazakhstan and look at how much they have. They're like the strongest superpower, apparently, in terms of all these like uh, these tech levels. And then you can even play as North Korea. Difficulty level impossible. <laughs> that is amazing. So if you guys do want to see more First Strike, we'll pull the trigger on the like button and let me know. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.